Ooh. Ooh. Oh, okay. 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 See, every single time I've got the POV, I've got the POV driver, we see a cool car. Oh my God, this actually looks so, so cool. I'm not even gonna lie. New angle, new video. So welcome back to the channel, guys. And in today's video, we are going to be going on a POV drive. Yes. But as you can see, we've got a whole new camera angle. I'm not gonna lie, I'm digging it. So as you can see, I've got the GoPro on, but this time I kind of wanted to switch it up and have two angles, you know what I mean? So you guys can see my face. You can also see what I'm looking at when I'm driving and also talk about something super important. So if you're new to the channel, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn those notifications on so you do not miss a video. And without further ado, let's get straight into it. Alrighty, okay, so start button, car's on. Um, you know, I can't lie, I didn't let it like warm up. I haven't let the car warm up. Um, it's still freezing cold, it's raining outside, miserable UK weather, and um, yeah, just a downfall making a video on a rainy day. So, yes, I've got something I really wanted to talk about, but before I do talk about it, I'm gonna get out of this parking lot or car park, and there's like a bunch of bikers over there, so uh, just gotta be careful not to run none of them over. Um, oh gosh, okay. Woo! Okay, just a pre-warning, I know it is going to be incredibly shaky only because I do not have a clamp that goes onto the mount that I have now, so it's not going to be stable. It's going to be a bit shaky, but I can't promise, I can't promise like a clean, non-shaky camera because it, it's going to happen. Oh man, it feels good to be on the road. It really does, not going to lie. I do love this angle, man. I can't stop like looking at it. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's nice. That's clean. Okay, like Cooper, that was that was pretty nice. So the thing that I actually wanted to talk to you guys about is a track day. Obviously, I know it's getting to winter now, so most tracks are going to be closed and stuff. But I really want to get a track day in in this car. You know what I mean? Because I won't be having this car for long, and I really would like to experience a track day through all the cars that I have. You know what I mean? Because it's something. Obviously, I'm into racing. It just, it just seemed right like to do it, you know what I mean? So, we've got to get one in. So yeah, I am actually going to be going to have a browse on the internet. When I get back home, obviously uh, after this video, I'm going to have a look at some tracks and possibly get a track day in because I, 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 need, I need to get one done. I really do, you know what I mean? Like, this car, I know it's a diesel. You know what I mean? I know I keep saying it's a diesel. It really, realistically, it doesn't really matter. It's not your track type of car that you'd be taking to the track. But nonetheless, who cares? You know what I mean? It's I'm only 19. You know what I mean? It's not like I'm gonna have a flipping GT3 or anything like that. <laughs> you know what I mean? So yeah, man, I just gotta enjoy with what I have, and I'm definitely, definitely gonna book a track date in this car, preferably sometime either this month or next month. We never know. So we're gonna be driving down the usual route. You guys know what it is. We're gonna go have a loop around Brom, and yeah, just have a have a quick chat. You know what I mean with the with the fans and whatnot. Because um yeah, man, I've got some cool things lined up ahead. Obviously, we went to that car meet not long ago, um, and obviously, I've got some contacts. So, um, yeah, you guys stay tuned because there should be some car reviews very, very soon. Um, hopefully, hopefully, one this month or a couple this month. But obviously, people are putting their cars away for the winter. So, um, yeah, just anybody who's willing to knock around their car in the winter, just hit me up, you know what I mean? Because obviously, if the, hey, driving cars like that, especially like show cars, around in, it's very, very risky. You know what I mean? You don't want anything to happen. You know what I mean? So that's why most people just put their cars away for the winter and then they drive another car. So, um, yeah, I'm just, let me indicate just so people know that I'm actually going to be turning, right? Lord, okay. This, this road is one of the worst roads to be turning on the car. Like, it is so frustrating. Super frustrating. The golf R. And he's just gone. It sounds so good though, man. That, you, you guys heard that. Okay, so I'm gonna edge out. Yep. Beautiful. And now I'm stuck behind a guy who has a black box fitted into his car. God. God's sake. Oh. Okay, he's going to Mackey's. I can't really go anywhere near so I'm just gonna slow it down wait for him to go on ahead so turn 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 all right there we go now we can pick up the pace keep it at 30 nothing more yeah man times of this car very enjoyable that's one thing for sure very enjoyable you know what I mean I love this car to bits I really do 
I really do. But obviously, it's not necessarily boredom. There's a bit of boredom into it, but I feel like now it just it's wise for me to, you know, book it down, start get or get uh, continue grinding. You know what I mean? And get the car that I really want. You know what I mean? And something that I can actually work on, which is the G86. So um, yeah, definitely gonna be having a look into them. Uh, oh bloody hell! Okay, all right, he's gone. So it's, we are good in the hood. So yeah, man, definitely, definitely something like that. BRZ G86. I don't think I don't really think. I know you guys in the comments. I do read my comments. I'm not even joking. I do. You guys was talking about like getting a Polo or something like that, or Golf or like an M40i. Yeah. But one, my insurance is it's not cheap. I promise you that it is not cheap. No way, it is not. You know what I mean? It is. <laughs> it is crazi honestly. Especially on like an M40i, yeah, that what two they're two liters or something like that, or two or higher, whatever. They're, they're hella expensive. Not like the car. Is that a G Wagon? That is it. That's a Brabus G. Is that. What is that? Okay, it's not. Oh. 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 Okay. 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 See, every single time I've got the POV, I've got the POV driver. We see a cool car. You know what I mean? It's just like. It's just, it's just one of them things that I see now. We just see a cool car all the time. I don't know where I'm going. I really don't know where I'm going. Um, so it looks like we're just gonna be turning around pretty much because uh, I went into the wrong lane. So yeah, okay, let's get into this lane here because we're gonna be turning right. We're gonna go back around on ourselves. So um, yeah, man, it should be hella exciting and I cannot wait. I cannot wait, you know what I mean? Because when I get my next car, whatever it shall be, just letting you guys know I'm going all out you know what I mean go big or go home you know what I mean like I want to go so big that to the point where I want to take it to SEMA you know what I mean something like that but it's it's gonna be it's gonna be a long journey you know what I mean it's not gonna be no easy one there's gonna be problems and I'm ready I'm prepared for those problems you know what I mean so um, yeah whatever happens we just gotta take it to the chest and uh, carry on I just realized I am low on petrol this thing now is just starting to guzzle up petrol, man. No word of a lie. And I'm, I'm getting like bloody, what? 32 miles to the gallon or something like that. You know what I mean? So it's not that bad, but for some reason, every single time I look down, you know what I mean? I've lost petrol. Like, I left the house, yeah, on 32 miles on my tank. I know it's low. You know what I mean? I'll just at the top of whenever I want. Yeah. I'm on 18, but I haven't driven the miles like it's it's telling me that i've driven you know what i mean i've driven like no more than two miles christmas is soon though i just i realized christmas is soon lord yo christmas is gonna be a mad one you know what i mean every single video when it obviously i did i did it last year every single video i do now yeah throughout december I, i've got a christmas hat on if i'm in public if i'm not in public i've got to have a christmas hat on you know what i mean it's by my law my youtube law you know what I mean? Like I have to have a Christmas hat on. It doesn't mean it doesn't. I mean I don't care if I've got one in public. You know what I mean? It's flipping December, Christmas. You know what I mean? So yeah, man, I'm excited. I'm pumped. So what's the matter? You know, what's with driving? I'm gonna answer some of the questions that I've seen on uh, YouTube, and uh, you know what I mean? Just just to give you guys some information on the reason why I'm doing certain things. So most of them, you guys are saying, where the hell is this consistency came from? And no word of a lie. I don't know. Okay, you know what I mean? I know like most of the days or most of the time now I'm uploading daily, you know what I mean? Sometimes it may be outside, sometimes it may be just games. Most of the time now, it's just me going outside and record recording whatever I do. But it feels like what, what I do for what I do throughout the day, you know what I mean, is things that I can record and it it makes sense for it to be as this is most like mainly my job, you know what I mean? So instead of me, obviously sometimes it's just nice to relax, you know what I mean, and just take a step away from the YouTube and stuff. But at the same time, because of what I want to achieve, I can't have no rest days, you know what I mean? Like I want to have the G86, you know what I mean? I want to have, I want to do stuff to the G86 mainly. Getting a G86 is no problem, but getting the stuff, or oh, getting the stuff to do, um, to do up the G86, you know what I mean? And actually, What's the word? Build up my fan base. That's what I need. You know what I mean? Because obviously I want you guys to tag along with me on the journey. So there's there's no room for resting. Obviously I have the 
the, 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 the pause every now and again where I'll upload and miss a day, then I'll upload, you know what I mean? Like this video, for example, I didn't upload yesterday. But then, like, I just have to keep going, you know what I mean? I know for me especially, it, it can be hard at times because sometimes I'll wake up and I'll think what I'm going to be doing today, you know what I mean? And know that in the back of my mind I've got to upload, but I'm here, you know what I mean? I still do the videos nonetheless, you know what I mean? You guys are loving the gas station videos, so obviously I had to do a few more of those, you know what I mean? And you guys st still love them even more, so yeah, man, that, that, that's, the, that's kind of the reason why I got this consistency, you know what I mean? It just makes sense for me to vlog pretty much my life, if that makes sense. We've been doing this for what, two months in a row now? Two, or like a month and a bit, a month and a few weeks. You know what I mean? And there's just been constant videos, constant videos, you know what I mean? So uh, yeah, I plan. I don't plan on stopping. You know what I mean? I, I really don't. But um, yeah, it's gonna keep going harder and harder and try and push out different content, you know what I mean? Because obviously I still want to do the car reviews, but I feel like with stuff like that, it's harder because as I said now, there are people who are putting their cars away for winter, you know what I mean? Certain people are flipping far away. I promise you guys, no word of a lie, we would have had so many car reviews, yeah, by now. But people are up in Wales. People are up in, like, Bournemouth, you know what I mean? And people, they, you may think, oh, wait, it's not far. It's a, it's a trip, you know what I mean? You stay overnight. That's the problem, you know what I mean? Like, I, ha like, I don't really want to be staying up overnight because if I still want to be doing, like, these daily videos and stuff, I can't, I can't be doing that if that's the case, you know what I mean? So, um... Yeah, man, we, we, we have to figure something out if, if stuff like that happens because obviously those those because I was speaking to a few people, but they're far away. You know what I mean? So with stuff like that, I necessarily have to be prepared. You know what I mean? And like prepared ahead of myself. You know what I mean? So it's just it's just one of them ones. It really is. And also some of you guys I was actually asking, what am I doing now since I finished college? And I'm, it's this, <laughs> you know, what I mean? I'm not going to uni. Um, don't really want to be going to uni and obviously the things that I could be doing at uni um, the, or the things that I, I'd, I'd want to do is like possibly like a mechanic course or something because I want to I want to have the knowledge and the experience I've got the knowledge I promise you guys I know the ins and outs of like like repairing and stuff so yeah experience that's all I need that's all I need I'm probably gonna try and find a place um, to obviously record um, like some stuff on you know what I mean even if it's down to like minor repairs or tire changes or room changes or stuff like that you know what I mean something I can just get an experience from because that's all I need ultimately I have the knowledge I play flipping car games 24-7 I play car mechanics simulator 24-7 you know what I mean I know about cars you know what I mean like you can point to any part in a car and I know what it is you know what I mean so uh, <laughs> yeah it's just it's just one of them ones it's just trying to find a place but yeah for now sticking on YouTube I'm not gonna do any uni or anything like that because I'm just done with done with stuff like that you know what I mean it's just time to get a grip myself push on the YouTube and uh, whatever happens happens man so yeah what we're gonna do now I'm gonna drive back home and yeah I'll, I'll talk to you guys when I get back home oh okay that was a nice drive that was a nice drive so we're gonna end this video here guys I hope you guys have enjoyed this video just stay tuned into the channel guys i promise you guys there's gonna be some super heat coming very very soon so hope you guys have enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe and catch you guys soon in a bit